Days after the terrorist attack by Islamic State in Jakarta, Indonesia's top cop describes the IS militant's plan to disrupt the country's public order as Plan B. In an interview with Reuters on Monday, Indonesian police chief Badruddin Haiti said the attack that killed eight people and wounded more than 20 others was a hasty backup plan after the group's original plot to cripple Christmas and New Year celebrations was exposed. Menurut saya termasuk yang plan B. Plan B. Karena karena sasaran utamanya itu adalah pada saat uh, malam Natal dan tahun baru. Gitu, malam Natal dan baru. Nah, nah dipilih eh uh, Tamrin ini karena memang uh, sebetulnya walaupun dia kecil diharapkan mempunyai dampak yang besar. Indonesian police had arrested suspected militants a few days before Christmas. During the violence at the intersection of Jalan Kiai Haji Wahid Hashim and Jalan MH Tamrin on January the 14th, about 14 suicide bombers and gunmen exchanged fire with police. The eight casualties include four attackers. Despite the low casualty numbers, Badruddin said a bigger attack could happen if the militants refined their skills and equipment. Tapi kalau dia merangkai beberapa uh, tempat itu saya pikir uh, semuanya bisa hanya kemampuan uh, bahan peledak dan uh, kemampuan uh, secara perorangan skillnya yang saya bilang uh, perlu karena ini perlu pelatihan. Police have arrested 12 people linked to the attack and found evidence the group had planned further attacks targeting security officials and foreigners in the cities. Indonesian militant Bahru Naim, who is believed to be with the IS in Syria, has been named as the mastermind of the attack after police tracked down transaction records of money to local accounts. Badruddin said the money came from Syria, but he could not remember the amount of money.